Hi friends, we are Timo and Sandra aka Monasi and we spent the last two years traveling through Europe full time in our self-converted van Parker. We lived the most amazing adventures and had the best time living on the road, made awesome friends and saw the most beautiful places. But now we're ready for something new. So we decided to go back home, pack our bags and get ready for a new adventure. Join us in this week's video as we get ready to leave Europe and move 16,000 kilometers away to the land down under. Australia. Good morning, guys. It's 4 something a.m. Um, <laughs> we're pretty sleepy, but we're getting ready. I'm having my hot water with lemon today. And we pack in everything that was remaining around the place, so. Yeah, we have, I think, half an hour or one hour till Timo's parents come to pick us up. And I'm not sure if we'll sneak a coffee before we leave. Probably not. It's a bit early. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. How are you feeling, baby? Yeah, I'm quite ready. <laughs> I think he's a bit more awake than I am, but that's just normal business. We forgot to show you yesterday, so these are our brekkie rolls. <laughs> It's bigger than expected, but hopefully we can fit everything. Then we have some pasta there with some um, vegan cheese and tomato and veggies. And then we made a little couscous salad. There you go. And we have a couple of those. Then we have some nuts there, some chocolate. It's our food for the next 26, 28 hours. Good morning. You know when your breakfast ball is too big, if you have to do the following. <laughs> We have to tape it down. Tell me you've been packing boxes for months without telling me you've been packing boxes. I'm an expert now. Well, I think with this amount of food that we have, we won't starve on this flight, that's for sure. I already did a trip down, the big suitcases. I'm not looking forward to first steps down with this 40 kilo suitcases, but we gotta do what we gotta do. So let's finish up the flat and then our ride is here soon. Our ride is here, so let's go. Goodbye house, thank you for a great time. Vámonos. We miss you. Honestly, very hard to push all of these things, especially because we didn't buy the best quality big suitcases and they don't roll anymore. <laughs> so, let's see how we do it. But let's check them in and then we just have to carry these guys, which is not too bad. to believe but we made it we ran so much honestly it was so stressful <laughs> but we are the first one to enter so that's it to Singapore. Guys, what a start to this journey. Uh, I don't know how much we actually captured because it was so stressful. We came to drop off our luggage and it turned out because we had overweight, which we knew, we booked 40 kilos so we can use 40 kilos for each suitcase. But after international law, your suitcase can't be heavier than 32 kilos, otherwise it's considered a cargo. So you went on a little solo mission, huh? And I stayed with all the baggage there. Yeah, the guy said, yeah, you have to go buy a new suitcase, so I went, but it was six in the morning and it was Berlin, so nothing was open. The girl just told me, yeah, I know this is an airport, but nothing opens until 10. So long story short. Our flight was at nine, so there was no 
no way we could have gotten a suitcase. Yeah, so we had to repack everything pretty much. We had to open every suitcase. Thankfully, Timo took an extra backpack. We had to repack into the small carriers yeah. and check them in. And, and while we were doing this, we actually got controlled by the police because they thought we were a bit suspicious. Maybe we were suspicious because of our sock and Berkey combination. Who knows? <laughs> because we were filming the whole packing yeah, yeah. situation. But they were nice, so just a quick chat and then... But despite arriving with almost three and a half hours before our flight, we had this thing. But then also the um, security control, was the line was so huge that there was no way we could have made it. We had to kindly ask if we could just cut the line, cut this in. Because honestly, like... Otherwise, we wouldn't have made it. Definitely not. And now we are in Singapore waiting, I think, three more hours till we take our next plane to Melbourne. And honestly, we haven't done this for a while, but it's exhausting. So of course. I yeah. feel a bit better than last time, but I'm also very tired. So the flight from Berlin to Singapore was 11 hours? 12. 12 hours. Also, we are delayed for one hour. Now we are waiting four hours. Uh, actually, six hours originally. Now it's just four left, I think. Yeah at the airport and then eight seven more hours, seven and a half, eight hours more <laughs> and then we finally made it. It's just weird because in our minds we left Berlin on a Monday morning and we're gonna arrive somewhere on a Tuesday night so yeah, it's yeah, yeah. like it's two days but it's actually not. It's just, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> we're gonna see if our flight will appear on the screen soon and then make our way to the gate so this time we don't have to rush and run through the airport. It was just uh, hectic. I remember running through the airport before Sandra because actually our one backpack full of food was not allowed to pass at first. So I ran already to determine it to try to hold the plane. I couldn't because there was passport control anyway. and I almost fell. Long day. <laughs> yeah, seven more hours and we make it. So see you guys in Melbourne. <laughs> This bathroom is pretty fancy, I have to show you. It looks beautiful. Wow. So we made it, we are in Australia now waiting for our luggage to arrive. The repack in the beginning, so it's gonna be four pieces. Let's hope they all arrive. Trying to find our friends Leash and Matt. They are picking us up, but we can't find them. So let's see where they are. Oh. Made it to the car. Yay. It's really dark. You might not see. Yeah. Be careful. You might be able to see. That's all right. Hello there. It actually looks quite nice. It's a very it's, Christmas yeah. tree. The first one we see. There's Christmas. so much luggage. We have to get up now, yeah. guys. Right. Well, let's get at it. See you in the room. All right, guys, we made it to the room. It was quite a mission, not gonna lie. We have way too many things, <laughs> but it actually, it's pretty nice. All you need: entrance, little desk, little bed, little chill area, bathroom. Voila! And this is all of us here. Anyway, we are very tired, and we're gonna go to bed. See if we can sleep, because honestly, we just feel weird. But anyway, this is it from us. We catch you guys tomorrow with the Melbourne coffee, which is the best part. See you guys. Good morning, guys. We slept amazing. I almost feel like we skipped the jet lag. Yeah. Morning. Let's, but I'll let's. See you at 5 p.m. Yeah, yeah. I wanted to say, let's see. So now we're gonna go for coffee, and um, also we have to get a SIM card to actually have internet on our phones. And, and a new number. And a new number and yeah, see the city a little so let's get out of the hotel room and um, explore the city. So now you're in Australia when your hotel over there is just next to a coffee shop that is, has actually decent coffee. Oh yeah. I mean it's not hard to find here. No. Cheers. Cheers. Let's get a so SIM card. So excited for our first Melbourne coffee. Woohoo. <laughs> And First sip on like, camera. This is like bonsoi. This is like the OG best milk ever. Oh yeah. Uh -huh. Nice. Feels 
feels good to be back. <laughs> That was quick and easy. Five minutes in, out, maybe ten. I, the, the, the one time I wanted to do a contract in Germany, I ended up crying after two hours. This was 15 minutes. All that. Happy days. And already we are back at the hotel. The breakfast was quite nice, not the best ever, but did the job. We actually already opened our Australian bank account, so that was also a very easy process. And now we yeah, just have to sort out the mess here, because as you can see, since we had this emergency packing yesterday at the airport, we actually just threw everything in different bags and now we have to organize, because also we're gonna go to the place where we're going to stay for the next six weeks we want to bring some stuff already today so that's what we're going to do chill a little and maybe see a bit more of map city what <laughs> <laughs> 